hello. Hi, this is Tommy. You know, before I say anything about the LP3, I've been thinking about rebranding. I don't know if I'll do this in a separate episode. I, I don't know. I feel like it would be a bit tacky to do an entire YouTube video just talking. I'm not quite used to just talking. Uh, yeah, I'm, I've been super introverted <laughs> in the past overall. Like, it's weird. I I like attention, but I'm, I'm also introverted. Uh, yeah, I just, I, I don't seek attention, but I like it, you know? Yeah, so. What was I just talking about? Uh, branding, yeah. I don't know about Mint Robot. It's a little too obscure. I think I'm going to go by Tommy Oz. Tommy Oz sounds pretty cool. It's a bit mysterious, you know, like Wizard of Oz, but it's also uh, the end of my last name. So it's it's more of a personal brand, but I've been told it's wise to keep your content separate from your personal life. And my last name is obscure enough that people can find me. But I mean, if you dig deep enough searching through Mint Robot, you're going to be able to find me anyways. So I think Tommy Oz is a, a solid rebrand. Like, yeah, it'll make me more noticeable and I'll be able to plug my social through all the friends I have on media and, and not just try to get them to go to this other channel, this Mint Robot. So yeah, I like Tommy Oz more. Anyways, let's get on to these, uh, what I was talking about for, uh, or what I, was some points I wrote down here for the LP3, Minecraft Let's Play 3. So my biggest inspiration for this Let's Play was by far Etho. Like I've, I watched a bunch of different, uh, Minecrafters. But Etho was the one I paid attention to, uh, like way back in the beginning. His first video, we go to oldest videos, is 13 years ago. And I actually watched, I remember watching this Boat Dispenser video. And the Boat Dispenser 2.0. Like, yeah, so this was my inspiration, Etho Slab. And in these videos, he doesn't even really talk. Uh, where's Let's Play? His first Let's Play is somewhere. He starts out really quiet, though. Like, maybe he does talk in this. No. So, yeah, he does, uh He's very similar to me. In, in the fact that he started out really introverted and he didn't play Minecraft to really make... Uh, <clears throat> he didn't play creative as much. He's more of a technical Minecrafter. Kind of like Mango, too. I think there was a... Cubed Mango or something like that? Cube Hamster? I'm getting my wires crossed here with... Uh, Minecraft YouTubers. Cube Hamster was another big one. He made this crazy... He always makes these crazy contraptions. Like... Absolute ridiculous redstone stuff. So yeah. I just... I have a lot of respect for... Some of the Minecraft YouTubers. I never really got into Dream. But I did watch... Some of Dream's content. Like his Hunter series. Uh, those are just good... Concepts, really good concepts. So yeah, my inspiration was mostly Etho. Just watching him uh, work out 
episode by episode. I mean, he started 13 years ago. So this Ethos been at it. He has been at it for <laughs> 13 years continuously. Like I don't even think there's any gaps in in his let's plays really. You know, episode 71 and we go to recent He's on episode 300, 500, 584. These are 30 minute episodes after editing. So yeah, I just got a lot of respect for these guys. Uh, Ethos, others. <laughs> uh, yeah. So that was, that was my inspiration for really starting this. But the reasons were, uh, I had multiple reasons. So starting with experience, I've never done a Let's Play. I've never really done anything like this. So yeah, I, I wanted to get some editing experience. Like I got DaVinci Resolve open here and it's nice. It's it's good experience. But I'll get to this in a second. It's three hours a day is, is just too much to edit. It's a lot of... It's so much... Like, if you work an hourly job, eight hours is... Like, it's a lot of time, and it sucks to be at an hourly job for eight hours. But... Doing a three-hour Let's Play and then editing for three hours... Like, you have to watch the three-hour video to edit it. Uh, and that's, like, six hours of... Even if the first three hours of the Let's Play are, like, fun, the next three hours... That's harder than an hourly job. It's harder than an hourly job, but also I get to be at home. And so there's there's some balance there. Like, it's more demanding, but I... I do have freedom. Like, I can take that three hours and split it up. I can work for one hour, and if I don't want to, I can do it later. But I do end up just working straight through it, like three hours, getting the whole editing done. So yeah, the first part is editing experience, and it turns out that's the three hours. It just leads to burnout. Like, I cannot do that every day. I woke up at 8 a.m. today to get my, uh, my plants. Make sure my plants have sunlight. Uh, yeah. So I just woke up and I have two Minecraft videos to edit. So doing this four times a week for three hours is just too much for me. And... It's, there's just not enough of a reward. Like nobody's, <laughs> there's not enough demand in watching hour long Minecraft Let's Plays when, when so many other people have done it before. Uh, but being famous or getting, uh, doing this Let's Play f just for views isn't exactly what my goal was. But it's like really not not leading to anything. Like, it's really. I thought something would come from it, but there's just no growth at all uh, at the moment. So, yeah, that's another reason for burnout. Is like while I'm streaming, I'm I'm streaming three hours. There's no viewers, and there's no comments on the YouTube videos. Like I. I've gotten comments on the YouTube shorts I've made, but not on this hour-long video that's taken way longer to uh, edit. So, reward versus work is... It's just way skewed out of proportion. Like, there's virtually zero reward for doing this, and it's a lot of work. But I'm still going to do it just one hour a day, and not, not three hours a day because of the experience because I'll get some editing experience and hopefully find like a, a zen and posterity 
I just want some sort of uh, foundation to my uh, to my content creating career. <laughs> that was a alliteration. Content creating career. Uh, yeah, posterity. I just want some sort of starting point. Like this is the starting line, and it's going to be the Minecraft Let's Play series. The third thing is fixture. I like Minecraft, and especially through Ethos Lab series, I've I've learned a lot. Like I, I haven't exactly done most of this stuff, and I'll admit. Once I got into college, like I only watched from 20, 2011 to 2014. Once I got into college, I just kind of dropped a lot of things. <laughs> college was quite different for me. Like, it was a transformative experience. And I unfortunately stopped paying attention to Ethos Lab. Uh, but I did just resubscribe to him today. And it is so impressive that he's still working on it. Like, I'm actually going to, I'm going to play one of these videos just to show you. Like, where, where's his first Let's Play? Re-recording here. Um, I'm just going to play the first 15 seconds of Etho's first Let's Play. Episode 1 and his most recent Let's Play. Oh, I got the cam in the way. Episode 585 and episode 1. Just the first 15 seconds. And you'll see the difference. is It's crazy. Hello everyone. My name is Etho. And this is my new Minecraft world that I've started. Uh, lately I've been having a lot of people asking me to make a Minecraft Let's Play series. And I thought, uh, hey, may as well try it. All right, so, you know, that's not bad, but he's he's quiet. He says, uh, a couple times. It's just not, like, fast-paced, you know? It's not super fast. So we'll see here the most recent. Totally different. This is Etho after Hello, 11 years. Welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play series. We are over here in the end today. We're still working on this giant storage system, this possibly huge mistake, because <laughs> we still don't know if this thing's going to work or not. We haven't uh, we haven't put all the pieces together and given it a try yet. That's what I'm hoping we're going to... So, totally different. Yeah. Just wanted to emphasize the uh, yeah the change over time. And, yeah, that's why I want to document that. He's a completely different person after 13 years, so. So, yeah. My third reason... Besides ex editing experience and posterity to, like, posterity is what I just talked about there with Etho. Like, you can go back and see his first video and how he talked, and then go to his current videos and notice what he does differently. Like, he's, he's changed, right? So I want to have these these current videos for me to look back on from the future. That's really most of the reason I'm doing this. Hopefully I won't be embarrassed. I probably will be a little bit, but that's okay. The third reason is fixture. I just want to have... Uh, I like Minecraft, and it's constantly being supported. Like, it's... It's one of those big games that doesn't go away. Like, League of Legends... Uh, World of Warcraft, I guess. Call of Duty. It's just a big name. Fortnite, obviously. Now Roblox is kind of in the Minecraft space almost. 
Minecraft is one of those games that just doesn't go away, and I want to have a... What's the word for those things on ships? They like... Uh, <laughs> the ropes that... Are they called lifelines? Yeah, a rope. Well, a rope thrown to rescue someone. I'm thinking of the movie Treasure Planet. There's a scene in Treasure Planet where there's this big storm, like a big uh, supernova. The ship's going through a, like around a black hole, and the black hole is actually exploding, going supernova. And everyone has to tie themselves to the ship so they don't get shot out into the void. And that's this is my like lifeline to Minecraft. Like I keep going too far out and losing my saves and having to restart like every three years i'll get back into minecraft <laughs> it's been it's been 13 years so i've restarted four times now so this this series will hopefully be a fixture to minecraft where i won't i won't get lost and have to restart again hopefully so yeah those are my three reasons for starting this Minecraft Let's Play. And sort of nostalgia. It's not really nostalgia, though. Because nostalgia would be, like... It, it's just not obtainable for me. It's Nostalgia was playing on a server back in Alpha when there were minecart boosters. And those got patched out, like, way in 2011. <laughs> So it's not really nostalgia per se, it's it's these reasons. So yeah, I talked about burnout in three hours is just not, I don't want to do that. Personally, I don't, well, my audio just spiked, shouldn't, shouldn't be doing that. Let's make this a 30 to 1 compression. I get, <laughs> this is just some... Some technical stuff I like about streaming. I have a compressor here, so it's still like capping out really loud. This compressor is supposed to activate when the audio source goes past minus 20 dB. If I take out the gain, maybe I just take out the gain or kick this to like seven okay i get a little distracted there that's what i like about streaming is it kind of it's a good mix of technical and um <laughs> attention components i like being seen acknowledged okay alternate path so instead of these Minecraft Let's Plays, I'm, I'm, I, I guess I'll do them for an hour every day still, uh, Monday to Thursday. So that's not nothing. It's it's just less. I'm going to be, uh, instead of streaming Minecraft most of the time, I'll be streaming other things. Like uh, League of Legends is pretty clippable. I like how clippable League of Legends is. And then Dark and Darker New Season comes out soon. Elden Ring. Um, I think I'm going to get Helldivers as well. Even though I don't think Helldivers is like as... It's not like a watching game. It's more like a playing game. <laughs> it's one that's fun to play and not as fun to watch. I think I'm still going to get that though for my for my own life. You know, it's Ultimately, whatever you do is about your own life. And you really don't want to incorporate things. You don't want to incorporate things that you don't want to do into your life on a daily basis. If you're doing something in your life that makes you unhappy uh, repeatedly, don't do that. Like, look for any way to not do that. <laughs> So yeah, that's that's what I'm doing with the well. That's why I'm going to play Helldivers, I think, 
even though it's not like great content is it's just it looks fun so i don't want to sacrifice myself having fun for the sake of good content i think that can apply to many things okay schedule change i think i'm going to add workouts to my stream I just want to have that in my lifestyle. I want to be like, you know, right now I don't work out. So little work I do is like, I just pick up these dumbbells every once in a while. And it's mostly like shoulder strength. These are 10 pound dumbbells. But if I, if I hold them like, uh, you know, torque is force times radius. So if I hold these far out from my body, it's it's a lot more work than if they're close. <laughs> so I've been holding it's it's only ten pounds, but I, I hold them at like max range and then kind of work with my shoulder. So my shoulders are getting beefed up right now. Like, obviously, my biceps aren't that big, and <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking about this on, on a Minecraft video, but you know what? Why not? And then, obviously, the forearm is could be beefier, too. I like how angles work. Like, the fact that if I put my hand, like, way back here, it kind of looks small. If I put my hand up here, it looks big. I got like a scratch on my hand from my nails. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so that's how angles work. If if you like move into the camera, your arm just looks bigger uh than if you look move away from the camera. That's so that's a little trick. Okay, workout. So yeah, I'm going to add workout to the schedule and probably Elden Ring. Instead of a one hour Minecraft, I'll do one hour Minecraft and then one hour Elden Ring. Minecraft future is looking grim. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to get back to the Let's Play. We'll see. I think it's just going to be something in the in the chamber, I guess going to be around so if there's a new update if there's some news i see uh, i'll get back to it yeah i guess that's it that's all i wanted to talk about you know we're taking it day by day so that's that's what today is you know that's what this week is it's the week of the first week of doing the minecraft let's play on stream Okay, I've talked enough. Let's get to the uh, crafting. Oh, wow, I stream this. <laughs> I meant to click record and not stream. That's fine, though. I can just download the VOD.